Hey YouTube, it's Divine Diva 71 coming at y'all right quick with this video. I came home from work today. My husband, bless his heart. I came in here. He had brought me these beautiful flowers. And he know I love me some flowers and these two M&M mugs. Because I love the M&M characters. They are so funny. So, start that off on a good note. But this is so pretty. I thought they were so nice. My husband, he, he always surprised me with cute little stuff that's so sweet. But I'm going to tell y'all something, okay? You know, when the weather gets warm and people, really, people, you know, they've been in the house all winter and then when the weather gets warm, people come out and they start acting up and everybody always say, yeah, because it's warm outside, it doesn't get hot. People out here clowning and blah, 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 blah. But see, we about ready to do a flip mode on that whole thing right there. We know about when it gets warm outside, how people act. But I'm going to tell y'all something that I've been noticing and I've been saying for years, okay? Now, folks taking heed to this. Me and my mama had this conversation. Me and my husband did. Me and my daughter. Me and my, a, a few of my friends of mine. They were like, Denise, that's so true. Because I'm telling y'all, I'm telling y'all what I know. I don't get on this camera. We talk about some stuff I don't know nothing about. I'm telling y'all what I know and what I heard and seen with my own eyes and ears, okay? Okay. Now, you know, we, I know here in Ohio, we coming up on the, you know, in the winter. It's going to start getting cold. And it's already getting dark. It's what? 7.20 my time? And it's already getting dark outside. You know, in the summertime, it don't start getting dark to about what? 9.30? Something like that, 9.45? It is only 7.20 and it's, it's getting pitch dark outside already, okay? Now, usually what it is, when people start committing all these crimes and stuff like that, really, I'm telling y'all, when it starts getting dark early, and it's going to start getting cold in a minute, because yesterday was our last warm day. Today got up to just about 60-something degrees today, okay? When that, start, when that weather starts changing like that, and that time change, and it's getting dark early, people don't give a, two ucks about your... Uh, They're going to start doing stuff, committing more and more crimes out here. Because you know why? They don't have nothing to lose. They don't have nowhere to go. When it's dark and cold out here, you know, these streets is angry. The weather here gets gets mad cold here in Ohio, okay? We can get down to below freezing here. So, when it start getting dark early, it start getting cold, these fools be out here on the streets doing the most. Do you understand that? They be out here doing a whole bunch of ish. There was a woman that was murdered Monday morning around 5.15, Okay. By some dude who just, he ain't got nothing to lose. 33 years old, he ain't got nothing to lose. A co-worker of mine, this is, I'm going to take y'all back to probably about 20 years ago. She was going to lunch. It was very cold outside that day. She was walking herself to, she was, walk, she was going to lunch and she went to the bank first, right? Some guy out of nowhere, just random act, nothing provoked, nothing. He came up on her. Knocked her cold clean out. Just, mm, knocked her out. So everybody rushed to her aid. And when the cops came to arrest him, do you know what he told them cops? Nothing else to do. It's cold out here. I'm hungry. I ain't got nowhere to go. So he just had to punch a woman out. Okay? Because he wouldn't go back to jail. Because he ain't got nowhere else to go. Okay? So... My thing is, you have to be careful out here, people. I get on here all the time and talk about this stuff because, like I said, I've worked in the criminal justice system for 27 years of my life, and I see this stuff. I Not just I've read this or I'm thinking this happened. Or I, I see this stuff, okay? I see this stuff happen a lot. So if you're going out in the dark, like to the grocery store or something like that, take somebody with you. Please, and watch each other's back because they out here snatching groceries. They out here snatching your car. When you go in and go get you some gas or pay for your gas and come back out and try to pump your gas, you ain't going to pump nothing because some fool done, done got in the car, probably with your baby in the back seat strapped and stole your damn car. These fools out here ain't got nothing to lose, y'all. I'm telling y'all. Especially, like I said, dark and cold. This weather grade, this weather gonna be a beast, and so are these human beings. They're gonna be even more of a beast. Okay? I ain't worried about in my neighborhood, there's deer out here. You know what I'm saying? You gotta be careful of that. You know what I'm saying? But 
my thing is the two-legged beast out here. Not the four-legged, the two-legged ones. Yeah. So, a friend of mine, she likes to go out to the store sometimes at night. She runs her own business. And sometimes she has to go out um, at night. And I was telling her to call me um, before I, you know, dismantle and get in the shower or whatever this and that and get ready for work or whatever to let me know so I can go with her. You know, well, I'm just going to do, do a quick run. But a quick run sometimes is, is still... People out here doing crazy stuff, y'all. I made a video last week about the stuff that that um, that's in the news when that when that food threw that baby in the in the um, Ohio River and threw that threw the baby's mother in there too. And I, I'm telling y'all, stuff out here is just is is unreal. But I'm telling y'all, these fools out here, they don't give a damn that you got a baby in that car. They don't give a damn that you're pregnant. They don't care if you're elderly. They do not care. Okay, yo, quit thinking. Well. I live in this, this kind of neighborhood. I make this kind of money. I drive this kind of car. You're not safe. Okay? Lock your damn doors. Why do you think they make locks on doors? Lock your damn door. Okay? Lock your damn doors when you go in the damn house. Lock your car. Lock If, you're, if your car parked outside, lock your shit up. Don't leave money and stuff out of your car or your cell phone. Don't leave a penny out. Because somebody, I, I'm telling you, People have gotten their cars broken into over a fucking dime. Excuse my French, but yeah, a dime. Okay? And, that, and, and now you got your, your windows busted out. Now that little sick, that little dime, they cost you several thousand dollars to get your stuff repaired. Or you got to pay $500 deductible to get your shit. You know what I'm, that's what I'm saying? Quit thinking you safe. You're not safe because you're white. You're not safe because you're you live in a, in a in a nice neighborhood. You're not safe because you're you're African American living in a, in a better neighborhood. You're Mexican, Hispanic. It don't matter. We, none of us are safe. None of us is okay. So cut the madness. Cut it. We're not safe. That's the sad part. And people think they are because they live oh they live half on the hill. You know what I'm saying? It's a couple, a couple years ago. Guess where they stayed? High up on the hill. And they and they both got they they both was 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 killed in that big old pretty house they stayed in. Because they felt safe. I don't give a damn my house was forty five million dollars. You I guaranteed you all my doors and windows gonna be locked up. Cameras and shit everywhere, okay? That's what I'm saying. You gotta be careful out here. Like I say, people out here don't have nothing to lose. Stop thinking you're safe. People don't have nothing to lose out here. They walk in the streets. They can look innocent sometimes, but they're not. Some some people, some people, not everybody, but they're not. You can see somebody who can look like 14, 15 years old. Oh, he have to snatch your purse and your car and probably stab you. Look what that fool did to that couple in New York a couple days ago. Okay. He 18 years old. The couple was coming from um, a wedding and he stabbed him, killed him. Really? Really? Okay, uh, y'all. Tell y'all what I know. That's why I say I just, I, I lay, when I say I lay low, I lay real low. I stay real low. I try to just look under the radar, man. <laughs> I don't want nothing to do with all that, okay? So if you're going out, just, you know, in the dark, especially in the dark, have somebody with you. That's all. Just have somebody with you. Okay. If you have your, you know, your CCW, whatever, make sure you got a little something, something, whatever this net. Because people out here are acting stupid, you know? And use if you go use a weapon, use it for the right reason. Not because somebody looked at you funny or somebody gave you back the incorrect change or you ain't get the food you wanted or some crazy stuff. People out here shooting for dumb, stupid, idiotic reasons, okay? I'm saying. But yeah, watch your back, your front, your tops, your middle, your sides. Watch all that, okay? That's all I'm saying. So y'all uh, stay safe. Please stay safe. Lay low, stay out the way. Like I said, it's, 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 the time going to be changed. It's going to be getting dark earlier and earlier. I know here in Ohio, it'll be getting dark at 5.30 when we had a time change. 5.30. Pitch dark outside at 5.30. I'm telling you, people ain't got nothing to lose out here. They walk up on you in a minute. They ready to stab you, rob you. They ready to snatch your car, everything about you. Snatch your groceries, everything. When they ain't got nothing to lose. They don't care. Okay? But y'all stay safe. Stay out the way and lay low. Get back with y'all in a couple days or something. Deuces.